Hey, Monsters, here we go. Happy Tuesday. It is the 7th of March. Uh, as you know, our procedures follow along on the slides of daily activities. Check your emails or Schoology. Support your team. Sit with your team. Work hard and be nice. Floor your water. Our Unit 4 challenges are there on the screen, um, as well as the Unit 3 challenges are still open that are posted on the window in the classroom. If you're looking for these slides, of course, you can pick them up on Schoology or on the bit.ly there at the bottom of the screen. Three Lima Golf, Alpha India, Zulu Golf. That's a capital golf and a capital India, but not the second golf. Table of contents for today. We are ending on a high note. Um, so we'll go ahead and get out of the way of Snoop here. I can complete a challenge on FuseStudio.net. I can ask clarifying questions of peers to help me reach my goals. How do I complete a challenge? Who's completed this step? I can write or speak to what I'm understanding. We interrupt this broadcast. That's right. Wanted to give you some quick notes on a couple of things. Here is a sample grade book. Obviously not real students. You can see my section is CW because these are guys from Buffy the Vampire Slayer and Smallville shows that aired on the CW. But we've got our little Bitmoji Niwem entering some grades. And you can see the highlighting kind of designates how the spiraling works in this class or how grades that are similar will overlap on each other. Let's start here with the orange. Um, you can see here that uh, Chloe did not do any of her summaries or previews during this particular unit, during Unit 3. But she did the makeup assignment on cheat day. That means this grade copies over here. That's how you make up that credit. That's why it's called the makeup assignment. So that helps you out on that. Uh, and then you can see the same would be true for Unit 4. You know, and then the makeup assignment comes out over here. Uh, moving on from that... We can see over here that Clark, Lois, and Lana did not do the test for spaghetti structures unit. Neither did Willow or Pete, um, but we're going to go ahead and just focus on these guys up here. They did, however, do the second summative, and the standards are the same. Therefore, these grades here can cancel out that, and that will actually help improve your grade. Now, I don't encourage you to skip quizzes. Because actually your grades will be better if you're doing the work along the way because then you can show that improvement along the way and have a higher overall grade in the first place. But in the case of these guys, it did kind of save their bacon. Uh, now we have, of course, Kara down here at the bottom. She didn't do this quiz here, but she did this quiz here. So the same principle applies. I can cancel out that one, get the grade for the spaghetti structures. This isn't hurting her, at least not yet. Still another quiz out here. Try to make up those points. Try to improve. You can see people that are just kind of in that low range. Like if you had a low score, Oliver Queen failed the Spaghetti Structures quiz, canceled those scores out. Um, but he's still got a four on standard CSO1. So he's trying to improve that, wants to improve that over here. That's the whole concept. So when you ask me, how can I improve my grade? Usually it's going to be by actually doing the work going forward. So watch for that makeup credit when it comes along. And then make sure you're actually putting the efforts in and doing your best on the test when that comes along. Okay, what are we serving up today in Fuse? We're going to start with our bow ringer. That's bow bridges up there. Um, trying to have some of that diversity of uh, all sorts. So getting a male in here for our bell ringer. How does your current challenge relate to the outside world skills? What are some of the potential positive and negative aspects of your challenge on the outside world? Then, of course, you're going to have Fuse Challenge Work Time, where you want to try to level up at least once. And we'll have our exit ticket. So I'm going to turn it back over to Live Niway to go ahead and touch on this bow ringer for today. Uh, we'll get some discussion going. We we'll use the spinner on the board to go ahead and call on people. And therefore, have a really good day. Be nice to everybody. We love you. Happy Tuesday.